Pimpoti vipi misijui Nina imani mopinsa juhi Nitapata ugonjo wa moyo Kusebabi ya mawazo Nina viju wa maisha yake Aja waiku wanaboyi pengi Nila ni mimi wakwanza Na nina shindu kumpata Kwa ishare na unikana na mpenda Yeye itimina mzinguwa Ejika mangeli kuwa na siki a Vasu Wangwangi ujua aha Kwa ishare na unikana na mpenda Yeye itimina mzinguwa Ejika mangeli kuwa na siki a Vasu Wangwangi ujua aha Ninge mzowe ya rafiki ya kibasi mi Ninge mtuma Ninge zitambua ishara zaki Kwa kimi Ninge fika Ninge mzowe ya rafiki ya kibasi mi Ninge mtuma Ninge zitambua ishara zaki Kwa kimi Ninge fika Sisi lini na mpendu Ninge kiziri Kuyo mungu wa moteku Ninge kiziri Sisi lini na fesi Nerves, 
so there is no sound moving from the middle ear up to the brain. So those are the causes. So the other cause is, so any disease to the ear can cause deafness. The other one is, we have the perinatal cause before birth, during birth, and after birth. What can cause deafness before birth? One, there is hereditary factor. Maybe the gene is hereditary, hereditary from the parent or from the family member. The other one is use of autotoxic drugs. Any drug which you are given by the doctor, make sure you check the side effects, especially to the pregnant and the lactating mother. So another one is accident by the mother during pregnancy, trauma during pregnancy. So during birth, what causes deafness? During birth, the factor which causes deafness is accident with the mother or the baby. If the baby falls down from the labor bed so that the ear is affected. The other one, bridge birth. Bridge birth. That one can also cause deafness. Any complication during birth, delayed labor, all those can cause deafness. After birth, somebody like me and you can also get deafness. So how can you get deafness? Disease, motorbike accident, car accident, all this, if it affects the brain or the ear, can cause deafness, bleeding from the ear. And then other causes after is otitis media. If it is untreated, it will cause perforation to the, to the ear. So fixation of the bones can also cause use of drugs. Don't misuse drugs. It can be either traditional or the herbal ones or given by a medical doctor. Use the correct prescription from the doctor and use your drug well. Or in case of any sickness, don't prescribe the drug to yourself. So on hereditary causes, we cannot control. But those deaf couples, you can advise them not because the deaf like to marry one another, endogamy. Advise them not to marry one another in case of hereditary because it can easily pass to their children. But for the others, please, the hearing community, embrace them, marry the deaf girls, they are very beautiful. Just go to Kisei Kenya Institute of Special Education, learn sign language, marry the deaf learners, problem zero. So we shall continue with our video on creating awareness, not only in September, even the months and years to come. With those few remarks. Well, fine.
the giftedness of my hand, in a sense, in their eyes, nature of my training makes me the proud teacher of the day. <laughs>